Now, it wouldn't be a motor show if there wasn't a new Ferrari to get all excited about. And this year, it's the 458 Speciale. And you can think of it as being the, the 458 version of the Scuderia. So it's more powerful and it's got less weight. So let's speak about the power. We've still got a 4.5 litre V8. However, performance has been increased by 35 horsepower. So you've now got 605. There's also 90 kilograms less weight on this car and they've achieved that by putting lighter wheels on it. In fact, in total, these new wheels save you 12 kilograms. There's also plenty of carbon fibre, if you come around here and have a look, used in the engine bay. So there for the inlet manifold, it's all carbon fibre and throughout the engine bay itself. There's more carbon fibre as well when you go inside the car. Look on the door trims, for example, and if you look at the dash as well, you see that's carbon fibre. The Speciale also has this unique kind of stalk sticking up out of the transmission tunnel and that's for controlling launch control and you also use it for, of course, the automatic gearbox mode selection. Now all that weight saving and the increased power means the 0-62 time of this car has fallen from 3.4 seconds for the normal 458 Italia down to 3 seconds dead. Another big feature on this car is the aero. So it's got quite different bodywork actually than the normal 458 Italia. One of the things is at the back it's got active aero. If I can just find the little button here, if you look, these veins go up and down depending on your speed to alter the airflow over the back of the diffuser. You've probably also noticed as well that unlike the normal 458 Italia which has three exhausts, we've got just two here but they're bigger and obviously quite more dramatic to look at. And if we come down the side, I'll show you some of the other air on the car. So this is new and this helps smooth the air down the side of the vehicle over the wheels. And once again, at the front, we've got a similar thing going on here. Now, these vents here on the top of the wings by the lights, I'm not entirely sure what they are for. I've asked, I've asked a guy from Ferrari and he said that his bosses haven't told him either. Obviously, the stripe, that stands out as being new and well, different than you get on the normal 458 Italia and these vents in here for the radiator that's different as well also at the front you've lost the those side blades sorry those air blades that alter the airflow into the radiator and what you have instead if you come around here is a new system which at 170 kilometers this opens and it moves the air over the front of the radiator like that so less air is getting sucked in so you can get a higher top speed. In terms of top speed, you're talking around 205 miles an hour. In terms of price, well, when this thing goes on sale and it will arrive in the UK probably next spring, it's gonna cost around 210,000 pounds.